As more people in Central Texas find other ways to get around town, we want to take a look back at how people used to move in Austin without cars. Tonight, KVU's Bob Buckaloo shows us Austin's early version of public transportation. The corner of 6th and Congress in Austin, an everyday scene frozen in time courtesy Google. Now here's that same view from around 100 years ago, when most Austinites got around town by streetcar. As early as the 1870s, they ran on mule power and cost a nickel to ride. Eventually, streetcars would use the electricity generated by the dam on Lake Austin. The powerhouse made the juice that ran the cars. But after the dam collapsed in the 1900 flood, it was back to mules for a while. And when electric power returned, one streetcar line ran all the way from downtown to a fashionable new neighborhood called Hyde Park. And the tracks were expanded along the Congress Avenue Bridge and onward into South Austin. Now, streetcar travel was not without its hazards. According to the Austin History Center, cars would sometimes just jump the tracks. Eventually, streetcars would lose a battle as more Austinites desired their own form of transportation, automobiles. And then came the buses. And when the last streetcar made its final run on Congress Avenue in 1940, there was a big celebration at 6th and Congress. Then the tracks were torn out. A couple of years later on Congress Avenue, no tracks at all. Much of the steel repurposed for the war effort. And historians say today you won't find any remnants of the old streetcar tracks in Austin. The end of the era of public transportation by rail. Or was it? As they say, everything old is new again. Bob Buckaloo, KVU News.